So this was not originally going to be a liberal outrage video at all uh, because I didn't think that what we're going to talk about here was a view that was really held by a lot of, of liberals. And I don't think it is yet, but it is starting to become more and more common. When I first heard about this, um, it's been a few weeks ago, it was kind of this viewpoint that I was hearing coming out of the UK. And then I saw a video posted on Facebook a couple of weeks ago, and then I started doing a little more research because I thought this was just so ridiculous, so utterly insane, that it had to be just some small, little, overly sensitive PC group of people who were just offended about everything. Until, <laughs> until I started seeing more and more people talk about it. Um, and what we're going to talk about here is digital blackface. Yes, that is a real thing. And, and as I said, I thought it was probably just some small minority group of individuals that were just getting overly sensitive and just getting offended about everything. Probably in this case, it was a, you know, a small group of black people in the UK that were, that were getting upset about this. But now it's, it's spread to the United States. And now it's not just overly sensitive people who happen to be black and so they are offended by quote-unquote digital blackface. But now it's starting to be white people and regular liberals too. And, and let me explain what digital blackface is. For all intents and purposes, it's when you share a GIF or a meme that has a black person in it. That's it. If you share a GIF or a meme that has a black person in it, you know there's a lot of GIFs out there that have Kevin Hart making funny faces because that's what he does. He's an entertainer, he's a comedian, and he makes funny faces in his shows. And a lot of people use that and take that and make memes out of it or GIFs or whatever to, to represent other things. That's a good example of what digital blackface is. So if you're not black, and you post a meme or a GIF with Kevin Hart's face on it, you have just been uh, a perpetrator of digital blackface. I, I don't know where to go with this. Honestly, it's utterly ridiculous. It's, it's insane. What does that mean? They can't post GIFs with white people in it? Or we can't post GIFs with, with I don't know, Asian people or Hispanic people, and Hispanic people can't post up gifts on Facebook with black people or with Asian people or with white people. I mean, when does this insanity end? It's just a gif. It's a meme. It's not racist in any way, shape, or form. Nobody's posting these things out there to be racist or to pretend they're black or to paint their face and whatever the hell they think is going on when you post a gif or a meme. I don't understand at all. It's, it's crazy. It's insane. And this is the world we live in today. This is the world we live in. You can't post a GIF or a meme that has somebody other than your color skin in it, you know, your quote unquote race, if, if they're not white and you're white, woo, I don't know. I don't know where to go with this. There's not really an answer here. It's just to throw it out there to you guys about how ridiculous liberals are being yet again. They took something that was some stupid, fringe, nut job ideology from some group that was probably, you know, five people sitting in a room trying to figure out what they can be offended by, and they've taken it, and they've run with it, and now this is a thing. Now digital blackface is a thing.